What you have to realize is that a lot of people, the thing that moves them, that makes them want to keep going is love. If you look at the Quran, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says to the Prophet, what did Allah say to him? When you finish the ibadah, what did Allah say to him? Fansab means what? Do another ibadah. You would normally think to yourself, if you finish this, then go, right? Relax, eat, yeah? Relax, right? But Allah says to the Prophet فَإِذَا فَرَغْتَ If you finish a ibadah, فَانْصَبْ إِلَى عِبَادَةٍ آخر. Go to another ibadah and, and busy yourself with it. You know why? Because he's in love, he's not going to stop. And that was the reality of the Prophet والسلام, And this falls under, as the Arabs say, إِيَّاكَ أَعْنِي وَاسْمَعْ يَا جَارَةً The Arabs have a saying like that. Well, I mean, the Prophet is being spoken to here, but he's not the only one who's intended here. إِيَّاكَ أَعْنِي You, I mean Muhammad, but I, everyone else, listen. You're falling under, meaning the qaida which is al ibrat bi umum al lafdi la la bi khusus al sabab. And that's what the Prophet's life was like. Look at what he said to Abilal when he ever found hardship or stress. What would he say? He would say, "Ya Bilal, arihna bi salah. Bilal, give us relaxation and comfort with the prayer. Do it then, so we can pray. We just think to our, we say ourselves, "Oh, I need to take this burden off myself." Subhanallah, I need because the ibadah is not a love for us. We don't love it. We don't enjoy it. And when a person enjoys something, he just, well, the scholars, they say, if a person has high aspirations and he has love for something, he's so passionate about it. The scholars, they used to say, may Allah have mercy on his body. Because he's going to destroy his body. His body is going to struggle. People who have, are in love, and you've seen it yourself, sahih. A man who's in love with a woman, huh? What did the poet say? أُقَبِّلُ ذَا الْجِدَارِ وَذَا الْجِدَارِ وَمَا الْجِدَارُ شَفَقْنَ قَلْبِي وَلَكِ لِمَنْ سَكَنَ الْجِيَارِ صح? He kissed the wall, he kissed the wall and he said to the wall, I'm not kissing because I love you. I love the one who used to live behind these walls. He was a woman he loved called Layla. See, love makes you, well, like another one, he loved a black woman. He loved a black woman. He loved her so much that he started to love everything that was black. He loved black dogs, black cats, black everything because he loved the black woman. Yeah. That's what did they say? Blood love is what? Love is blind, that's what they say. Alakulid, when you love Allah Tabaraka wa Ta'ala and it truly settles in your heart, you're unstoppable. And an ibadah that's motivated and it's, it results and it reverberates and it comes from and it springs from love, there's no way of it stopping.